Assalamu alaikum. Hi dear students, how are you? Hope you are well, by the grace of Allah. I am Muhammad Imran Khan, assistant teacher of English, Ranguni MMP High School. So welcome to our online class. Today I am going to discuss <coughs> your written part, name, pi and pie chart or graph. In your exam paper, you can see a question uh, usually come named pi or chart. You have to describe pi or graph chart uh, in this way. So today I am going to discuss how can you describe or how can you write pie chart or graph just uh, focusing on the graph or pie chart. So let's see in your pie chart. Today we are going to discuss a very common topic and it is uh, actually come to your boot question in 2019. The choice of profession by different educated youths in Bangladesh. So in the boot you can see there is a pie chart. So in the pie chart there are some descriptions or there are some hints or there are some uh, there will be some instruction for you and you have to write down the instruction based on the instructions so elaborately you have to highlight some, some basic points you have to highlight some uh, <coughs> or compare the basic points so what have you seen in the pie chart the chart shows the choice of professions by different educated youths in Bangladesh in the chart you actually you can see a chart there are six parts or six portions in the chart so the very big portion the very big portion uh, you can see 40 percent in the uh, second one you can see 30 percent in the third one you can see 10 percent uh, in the fourth or next eight percent seven percent or five percent that means there is gradually lower gradually going to the lower portion of the chart. So, uh, it is actually something like a, a sequence uh, that means something sequence. So in the very right side uh, there are some descriptions of percentage. The percentage is that 40 percent prefer government job, 30 percent like private jobs, 10 percent like foreign jobs, 8% like business, 7% like ICT jobs and last one 5% opt for farming. So how can you describe the chart by your own words? So this is a very simple and common thing that you can describe the chart by your own words. You need not to follow blindly any kind of books or any kind of guides. So how can you describe the chart? You can start this way the pie chart shows the choice of profession in this way you can start the pie chart shows the choice of profession the subject matter always been given in the very question the pie chart shows the choice of profession by different educated youths in Bangladesh this is the question for you and you have to start the description of the chart in this way the chart shows the choice of profession the choice of profession by different educated youths in Bangladesh so this will be the first line of the pie chart then you have to describe or you have to highlight the main focus point of the chart how can you highlight this is very actually given in the chart first of all you have to highlight the very first portion and which is the highest portion of the chart we can see 40 percent 40 percent is the last portion of the chart that means you have to start with the last portion of the chart what is this this is government job that means our young our young generation young generation uh, prefer which government job 40 percent from 100 percent 40 percent youth or young generation prefer government job and 30 percent like or prefer private job 10 percent like foreign jobs 8 percent like business 7 percent like 
ICT jobs, 5% like farming. So, it is <coughs> a matter of great sorrow that though our country is an agricultural country, our youth generation or young generation actually did not like to, do not like to do farming. Why? What is the reason behind that? We have to find out the reason why they don't like to be a farmer. And wherever 40% people or 40% youth or young generation like government job, why? Why young generation like government job? We have, if you see the depth into the government job, uh, people mostly, uh, young educated people like government job because it is more secured and more prestigious job than any other jobs in our country. Then 10% like private job. Those young educated who do not get chance or do not get a chance to be a, a job holder of government employee, he or she usually like private job because private jobs are available in our country. Then our <coughs> there is third person uh, comes with 10% like foreign job. Why? The brilliant students, uh, the meritorious students usually alluring with the foreign countries or with the developed countries and they usually like to go to the foreign country and they prefer foreign jobs because foreign uh, jobs actually provide them a better salary, better uh, health condition or better <coughs> their life condition. Then 8% young educated people or student like business, like to be a businessman. Why they like to be a businessman? If they, uh, most of them are uh, usually go to uh, take business for as their family business or usually or likely or unlikely they go to uh, be a businessman. Number and third, the last, uh, not least actually, seven per person like to ICT job. Though it is very important for develop a country, it is uh, really a matter of sorrow that only 7% student or only 7% young educated like to ICT related job. Though government uh, have to or should try to encourage students to like ICT job. But the very last portion, 5% of our young educated people or students like farming. But though our country is an educated, is an agricultural country, our students or our young, young youths actually do not like farming. So it's, government should come forward to encourage them to provide them different training, uh, different tra uh, training in, from different training institutions. So they uh, have to be perfect or they have to be qualified for farming and in this way uh, our young generation will, will be encouraged through farming and through agriculture. So what have you seen in the graph? You have to analyze in the very last part of the uh, chart. First of all, you have to describe what are in the chart. Yeah, actually, we have described what are in the chart. 40%, 30%, 10%, 8%. 7% or 5% that we have been already discussed. That means you have to describe the very first person or wh which is the highest or which is the lowest part of the chart. Then you have to analyze the chart. So what have you been found in the chart by analyzing? Then you have to write down analyzing the chart. The very last part of the chart, you have to say like that, analyzing the chart, we can say that or we can find a point or we can come to a conclusion that 40% prefer government job because of its security, its safety and its it is a prestigious job in our country or people consider it very prestigious and it is secured and safe. That is why 40% young educated youths prefer government job.
but it's a matter of great sorrow that only five percent young educated people like farming though ours is a agricultural country they don't like to be a farmer there are some a uh, lot of drawbacks and some superstitions being an young educated how can an be an educated person would be a farmer it is really shame for us because we are agricultural country so analyzing the chart the 10 percent the second one is 10 percent like private job and then the comes the lower portion is the foreign jobs the business like ict jobs and ops so government should come forward to encourage ict sector related jobs and farming so have you may, maybe you got the point and this all for today maybe you have a graph or chart the chart will become in this way of graph or will become in this way of chart so uh, you can actually describe whether it will come graph or whether it will come chart you can uh, describe very easily by seeing the graph what are in the graph and what are in the chart so that is all for today we will discuss uh, about graph in our next class so stay safe stay <coughs> home Thank you very much for being with us.